Hey there fellow webmaster. Welcome back to Ragnar TV. I'm Christian and today we are diving into the exciting world of containerization with Docker on Alma Linux OS. And if you're interested in streamlining your website hosting experience, you've come to the right place. So stick around because by the end of this video, you will have a comprehensive understanding of Docker. We will share with you a step-by-step -step guide on how to install it on Alma Linux OS. And before I forget, please do note that this tutorial will assume that you already have a running server with the Alma Linux operating system on it. If you haven't already, you can check out our tutorial, which I will link in the description down below on how to order a VPS hosting service with us here at Racknerd. All right, so now with all that out of the way, let's go ahead and get right into the topic of today's video. So the first thing is you may be wondering what exactly is Docker? Well, Docker is a powerful platform that allows you to build and ship as well as run applications in lightweight containers. It enables you to package your applications and all of its dependencies into a single container. This makes it much easier to deploy and manage across different environments, which means that you can eliminate the infamous, it works on my machine scenario and ensure consistency across your hosting environment. Now let's talk about the benefits of using Docker to host websites. One major advantage is isolation. Docker containers keep your application separate from the underlying system providing enhanced security and preventing potential conflicts between several services. Additionally, Docker allows you to scale your application effortlessly by replicating containers, enabling you to handle a varying level of traffic smoothly. So why would you want to use Docker for hosting websites? Well, imagine having the ability to quickly set up and tear down your development, testing, and production environments with minimal effort. Docker simplifies the whole process, saving you time and resources. Plus, it works seamlessly across various operating systems, making it a versatile solution for your hosting needs. Now let's go ahead and dive into the installation process of Docker on Alma Linux OS, and let me share my screen and let's get started with the tutorial. So as mentioned earlier, make sure that you already have a server running on Alma Linux OS. I'm using Alma Linux 8, although you can use any other version you want of the OS. But if you are following along with this tutorial, you will want to use Alma Linux 8 to avoid the confusion of the differences between package managers command formats. So now let's go ahead and log into our server. I am using Bitvice SSH client for this, but you can use absolutely anything else that you want, like for example, Putty. And before installing any new software, it is crucial to update our system to the latest packages. So please run the following command to do exactly that. This may take a while, so just be patient and let it do its thing. Once it's done, it's time for us to install some Linux tools and required dependencies. We can do this by installing the necessary packages for Docker to work correctly. Enter the following commands to do exactly that. Once done, we need to add the Docker repository to ensure that we have the latest version. To do this, we'll run this command. We're almost there, let's install the Docker engine using the following command. Once again, this may take a little while, so just be patient. To start the Docker service and enable it to start on boot, use the one line of command that you see right here. And next, let's go ahead and verify our Docker installation. So to ensure that Docker is installed correctly, let's check the status by executing this command. And there you have it, you have successfully installed Docker on Alma Linux OS. Congratulations on taking the first step towards optimizing your website hosting with containerization. Docker is an invaluable tool that can simplify your development and deployment workflows significantly. Before we wrap it up, don't forget to check out Ragnar.com for top-notch hosting services. Whether you're a beginner or an experienced developer, Racknerd has the perfect hosting solution for you. Furthermore, if you found this video helpful, please give it a thumbs up and subscribe to our channel here at Racknerd TV for more exciting Docker tutorials in the future. And feel free to leave any questions you have in the comments down below. Thank you for watching and happy hosting.